Tax increases aren't usually very popular, but a new poll shows a large majority of Idaho voters favor increasing the state's tax on cigarettes by $1.50 a pack. Justin Kaur is here to tell us more. D supporters of the proposal say the money could be used to cut the state's budget deficit and fund programs to help smokers quit. But opponents say this is just bad tax policy. A new poll shows that 73% of the 500 Idaho voters contacted would favor a $1.50 per pack cigarette tax increase. Former smoker Ken Chandler says the tax hike can keep people from picking up or continuing the habit. It's got to help. Hopefully, you know, that's what it does. It especially deters people from smoking at all or even starting. I mean, why spend that, that first money on a pack of cigarettes? The huge majority of those who favored the increase says they would want that money used to fund programs to reduce tobacco use among kids, help tobacco users with non-smoking programs, and prevent cuts to Medicaid. The poll was conducted last month on behalf of a coalition of public health groups like the American Cancer Society. They all held a press conference Thursday touting the idea that they say can save lives, save health care costs, and make more money for the state. The Idaho public has said we want to do something about smoking. We can have an opportunity at this moment to not only decrease smoking and underage youth smokers, prevent smoking in those same kids, decrease the amount of smoking in adults, and at the same time raise revenue for the state that's now $350 million in the red. But merchants say this is a case of the majority, non-smokers, pushing around the minority, smokers. But the right of the many over the rights of the few, you know, that's not what we're about in America. Just, just because you got, there's more of you doesn't mean you can dominate the, the lesser. Idaho's current cigarette tax is at 57 cents per pack. And while that ranks 42nd in the nation, Jones says the state's budget problems shouldn't be put on the backs of smokers. How, how smoking a cigarette has it anything to do with the state's uh, budget deficit on schools, education, um, Medicare. I don't see the connect there. Proponents of the idea say they're already talking to legislators who might be willing to sponsor a bill next session. Dee?